Hello everyone. Today we are going to introduce the Bangladesh with this economy, the society, and the population. Bangladesh locates in the South Asia, which is bordering with India and in the north of the Bay of the Bengal. The Bangladesh always use the Bangla and English as the official language. The climate and the season of Bangladesh is determined by its geography location. Bangladesh crosses the Tropic of Cancer, and its climate is tropical. Bangladesh has a mild winter from October to March, and its summer from the March to June is hot and humid. From June to October, Bangladesh has its monsoon. Season and most of the country's rainfall supplied in this period. Bangladesh has a population of 157 millions, which is the eighth largest in the world. The population growth rate is equal to 1.6 percent. Bangladesh has 840 dollars per year, which is the average wealth of the citizen. The、average education level of Bangladesh is 57.7 percent of total population. That means a half of Bangladeshi don't know how to write. In in this slide, we introduce etiquette and negotiation of the Bangladesh. In the Bangladesh, when you want to negotiate with the Bangladeshis, meeting etiquette and the business etiquette is important. Bangladesh are quite indirect communicators. It is important for people who came from direct culture to notice that communication is formal and flows a hierarchical structure. Deference to the most senior person in the meeting is necessary. Lack of smile in common, which has nothing to do with the unfriendliness, but rather related to the serious attitude. When greeting. Greeting usually take place between the member of the same sex. The handshake is common. When speaking with a woman in a business meeting, the space is necessary, should be increased. Because of the religion of Iceland, the traditional Muslim greeting is "Assalamu and Alaikum," and response is "Wa Alaikum Salam." The age dedicates how people are addressed. The fashion is different in the Bangladesh. Older people in Bangladesh may follow the Muslim style. However, the youngest people who are in favor with the fashion may care about how to make up and care about the eye care, hair care, nail care, and body care, just like the people around us. For the politics, the Bangladesh is a unitary state and. Parliamentary democracy. The economy of Bangladesh is its capitalist economy and is developing rapidly recently. The, the textile and the garments are the largest source of the foreign er, exchange earnings. As well, remittances from the Bangladeshis working overseas also contribute another major source of foreign er, exchange earnings. Because of the nature conditions. Agriculture is essential for many Bangladeshis to earn their life. As well, communication and energy infrastructure are developing. The major endowments of the Bangladesh are abundant labor resource, rich agriculture lands, and substantial reserve of the natural gas and coal. The GDP of the Bangladesh is equal to three hundred and twenty-four point six billion dollars. Which is the forty-fourth largest in the world. The GDP per capita is equal to two thousand one hundred dollars. The GDP official exchange rate is equal to one hundred and forty point two billion dollar. The G- gross rate of the GDP is four five point eight percent. GDP composition. In consist of the household consumption, the government consumption, investment in fixed capital, investment in inventories, exports of the goods and service, import of the goods and service. 
the gross nation income is equal to $840. The currency the Bangladesh is used is Taka. One US dollar is worth close to the 60, 76 Bangladesh Taka. The federal tax rate is also important to do the business in Bangladesh. Individual income tax rate is 25% and corporate income tax rate is 45%. It's pretty high. Tax and the revenues have 12.3% in GDP per year for the Bangladesh. Who is the most important import partner of the Bangladesh? The answer is the China. China has occupied 21% 0.7% of the imports of the Bangladesh. And the China removed the import tariff of to the 84 types of commodities from the Bangladesh. US, the most important export partner, applied ad valorem tariff on Bangladesh apparel, which is range from 12% to the 25%. Depends on the commodities. The major export and imports are the garments and refined petroleum. As I mentioned before, the garment industry is backbone of the Bangladesh, which contributes the majority of the GDP of the Bangladesh. The major transportation ports of the Bangladesh is the Chitago, which is the major seaport and container port. Mangla port is the most important river port. Minimum wage of the Bangladesh worker is 9 cents per hour. It is pretty cheap for foreigner investors to set up their industry because of the cheap labor source. Agriculture, manufacture, and service are three main sectors of the Bangladesh economy. There is an organization of the garment manufacturer in Bangladesh which is called Bangladesh Garment Manufacturer and Exporters Association. There are 4,000 members in this organization, means there are almost 4,000 domestic manu uh, garment manufacturers. Bangladesh is famous with its agricultural raw material like the tea, jute, and leather. As well, the Oros is the, also well known in South Asia as the industrial raw material. Let's talk about investment in this slide. Because of the relatively low correlation with the developed country start market, the Bangladesh performed best in Asia in the global recession. The Bangladesh stock market capitalization crossed 50 billion in 2010. That means a huge potential waiting for the uh, foreigner investor. As well, the Bangladesh government encouraged foreigner investors to set up their industry in their country. For example, they provide the privilege like 10 years tax-free for the uh, foreigner investor. After I introduced the economic situation and the investment environment of the Bangladesh, some investors may ask, is that safety to invest my money in the Bangladesh? So there are some limitations you need to be taken into consideration. The first, the law is not effective. Corruption is a serious impediment to investment, and the bribe is necessary for doing business in the Bangladesh. As well, the contract enforcement and dispute settlement are inefficient in Bangladesh. As well, the regulation limits is also important. Labor market is undeveloped. Government maintains extensive system of price control and subsides. The Bangladesh government is one of the limitation of the, the investment too, because because of this high level tax rate. Like the income tax rate remains at twenty five percent. The high tax rate may cause the high price level of the goods in the Bangladesh. Fortunately. Bangladesh government said the low-level tax rate for the foreigner investor to set up their industrial.